Hey Dan, so this is my video response to your nuclear power video. I'm, ever since the incident in Japan, I have been really intrigued and interested in different ways that we can energize the world. So I'm going to be talking about my top four. So number one, solar power. Harnessing the sun's energy to produce our own. So it, it does have its up and down. Most middle class families can't afford to, to put solar panels on top of their homes. So there's two options. One, a tax deduction. We get huge tax deduction. Right now there is a tax deduction, but not many people know about it. So just for the first 10 or 20 years of the solar power project, we can have a tax deduction almost for the cost that it, of the panels for families to choose to use solar energy as their primary energy source. And option number two, put the, put solar panels on town and city buildings, such as town halls and schools and buildings like that, town-owned buildings. Energy source number two, wind power. Conversion of wind energy for our own energy. People are against they don't want just windmills to be put off the coast of the United States or in towns and city land. I personally think windmills are pretty. I think that hundreds of windmills off the coast of the United States or in a field just looks beautiful. Um, so, again, there's two options. One, force it. It is the United States, but who says there needs to be a vote if we just put one windmill in every town? And option number two, for those who are in favor of wind power, you can have windmills on top of your house or at the end of your street. So there can be a deduction, again, on, ta on, their, on those people's taxes. Energy option number three. Tidal power. Generating tidal energy for our use using tidal stream generators or barrage generators. The ocean is huge. We should ha put these everywhere. You can't see them, and with precise placement, they won't affect sea life. And I just think that once the idea gets out there, they're going to be all over the world. And finally, energy source number four, biomass. Biodegradable waste and dead plants, trees, etc. burnt into a pile of mush for energy. Just man-made power. We've had it for years, but we haven't used it as much as you should, like safe power. For years, nuclear power was the way to go. It was safe and it wasn't, but power plants haven't been put in great locations. I don't think on the coast of anywhere there should be a power plant. It just does not seem safe to have a nuclear power plant in on, on the coast or near the coast of any ocean. It's windier, there's a chance of a tsunami. I, I agree with you that placement is an issue, but I also disagree with you that we can move power plants. Nuclear energy can't be moved safely. So, that's my input. I hope some of you agree, and I hope some of you disagree, because if I was right for everything, then I'd be kind of scared. Bye.